What's going on everyone? Steven here. Uh, today I am starting an Elex Let's Hack video series. Uh, today is Sunday, October 15th. The game comes out in two days on October 17th. I went ahead and hacked into THQ Nordic servers really quick just so I could download a copy of the game for myself. So don't tell them or anyone please or I might go to jail for hacking into their servers. Um, and of course I'm kidding. Thank you THQ Nordic for the early access copy. The game so far has been great. If you enjoy Skyrim, that sort of RPG, I think you'll enjoy this game. No, it's not even remotely close to Skyrim in terms of depth, the way it looks, or any of that. But core gameplay and story-wise, I think this game is very compelling. I think you might enjoy it, alright? So anyway, if RPGs are your thing, check it out. Um, as for some cheats that I've gone ahead and created, um, just with the four that I have enabled over there in Cheat Engine, you can pretty much just wreck the game and go anywhere you want. So first is Infinite Jetpack. So uh, you get a jetpack really early in the game, and the Infinite Jetpack lets you just fly all around in the environment, anywhere you want to go. All right. Um, yeah. So, I'm not sure. I haven't gone to any other, like, lands, biomes, whatever you want to call it, yet. I've just been cruising around this one place from basically where you spawn and start off the game. <clears throat> because of my no damage cheat, uh, nothing damages you. Fall damage, um, status effects that might otherwise damage you, enemies damaging you, none of that damages you, so you're all good. Infinite Stamina means that you can just run around without losing any of your stamina. And uh, one hit kill enemy. So that's a really good one and convenient because this game, right off the bat, um, you know, this is a mechanic that you've probably seen in a lot of games before. They basically make enemies that can destroy you in one hit. And they'll be somewhere in the area of where you're starting off or something you know like maybe you need to gain 20 or 30 levels before you can attack them um, so it's basically a way for them to keep you from going to that spot in the game until they want you to be there or get whatever's there right uh, but with one hit kills you can just take out anyone so when I pull out my weapon you'll see this guy's name will have a skull by it you had better put that weapon away all right, so that means don't mess with this guy because you will likely die instantly. But with one hit kill, donezo. Right. Take that guy out. Roll towards this chica. Take her out. Take this guy out. All right, so as you can see, the one hit kill cheat, very, very handy. All right. Um... Yeah, so that's it for like a nice little introduction to the series. Uh, like I said, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create these cheats yourself. Um, uh, which is great for as they update the game. Like I could provide a cheat table for you to download, but as they update the game, it might break the cheats. And I just really don't have the time to keep going back and updating cheat tables for every single game that I do. You know what I mean? So that's why I do videos showing all of you how to create the cheats yourself. So anyway, thanks so much for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Let me know if there's some particular types of cheats you might like to see after the game comes out. Um, then maybe I can go back and do a video on that type of cheat if it gets enough requests or something like that. So yeah, that's that. Thanks again for watching, and I will just see you all in the next video. Take care.